everybody. This is Mickey Adams in Dallas, Texas. Thank you all so much for tuning in for all your comments. Here's another great song, uh, especially for beginners. Is uh, It's quite simple. It's wonderful tonight. It's in the key of G. We're going to start off at position 10 with strings 5 and 8. Okay, so let's place our bar at 10, our thumb on string number 8 right here, and either one of your picks on string number 5. It really matters not at this point. The melody line sounds like this. It's going to be quite simple to begin with, and we'll make it a little more complicated and involved as we go along. But the simple melody line is this. Okay, well let's look at this simple phrase. and then come back and play the same thing C major D major again A and B pedals A pedal only move up one string group now slide to 11 into the F lever as well and then resolve back with either the A pedal or the A and B if you're striking three strings is only two. Now here's the same move from the D back up to the one chord, in this case the five to the one, but we're going to use strings five and six only. A and B pedals, 13 release A and B pedals, and at 15 we're going to re-engage as we're sliding. And then we're going to resolve with the pedals up. Now there is a difference in timbre because the strings are a little uh, wider and some of them are wound. Of course, once we get off our flat strings, we get to our wound strings, they have a different timbre. And what I mean by that is this F sharp does not sound the same as this F sharp or this F sharp. That's the difference is the timbre. So now we've learned the basic melody line. We can jazz it up a little bit. to position number three and let's play in the key of G as well same same line but let's uh, let's play some open strings now if you're the only voice in this song is the pedal steel and you're playing the ma main melody line well if you have a guitar player to harmonize this with you you may want to play single notes but this is much fuller Again, strings uh, three and four, one and two, A pedal with four and five, slide up to five, fret number five, play the same phrase again. Now let's go to five and six with A and B pedals. This is our four chord C, back to the G. Now we're in D and we're gonna move up the scale and then resolve back into G. A pedal only, A and F at 11, and slide back into 10 with the A and B pedals. Now, I've got A and B because I may want to use this note, but actually A is the only one that's active on these two notes. Okay, that's the F lever, major third, minor third. goes to the four chord to the five. Now this particular grouping is five six eight and then five seven eight with the B pedal and E lever. D straight D major. Now this is just a G walking down to an E minor. Just this is the E lever. Now this can be played 
so many different ways and so many different inversions. getting something out of this. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Please send your comments and don't be afraid to rate. We'll see you right back here at the, the Pedal Steel.